deceleration phases are marked by a consistent and persistent decline in the number of new cases per day. Um, when scientists and um, um, people who look at the data start to record the number of patients per day, once they see this indication, um, they obviously will notify um, the authorities involved. But what is most important is that there is no let up in the mechanisms and the measures taken to get to the deceleration phase. So that is why many authorities will be very cautious in declaring that the pandemic is decelerating in the first place. The main vector or the main means by which we can get herd immunity would be through a vaccine, which means that isolation efforts would still be paramount, while studies that are currently underway for vaccines should continue um, until we get positive results. So yes, I think an important clarification of that policy is that we don't intend um, for the infection to just run rampant in the population. I think what was really meant um, was that um, uh, we hope that those who have been infected may develop some form of immunity. And we also um, hope and are optimistic that vaccine trials will come to completion for us to deploy that vaccine um, across the globe. different countries have different responses to the pandemic, which means that in terms of predicting when this will happen across different countries in Europe, in other countries in Asia, and even in um, the Americas, it's quite difficult to say when that will happen. Um, but it is hoped that with these continued self-containment measures, self-quarantining measures, that we will start seeing some of these declines um, when the pandemic has burned itself out. <music>